This is from Game God. It is called Pix Artist. It says, just a small pixel art project. A to draw, arrow to move the pen, B to change the opacity and the shade. So this is using a grayscale palette, which is pretty cool. So I'm going to launch the simulator here. I wish I'd put this on a, on a device. I didn't, I didn't think of that until just now. So this would be a cool one to put onto something like a Pi Gamer. It would be really cool to see it on there. So here it is. If I uh, take a look at the way this works, I'm going to move just using the D-pad. I'm using the arrow keys on my keyboard. It'll move this little cursor around. If we press the A button, it will leave behind some pixels. Head over here. And while you're moving, when you don't press that, it won't. Uh, let's make some sort of suspicious looking little guy there. And the cool thing about the grayscale palette is that we can head down to the uh, B button and that's gonna toggle between 16 shades of gray. So I can go down to some sort of grayscale here. Uh, it'd be fun to also change the pixel brush size uh, and, and other features, but it's pretty neat. It's sort of adding in the capabilities that we have inside of the editor, which if you go and uh, hit edit code and head over to the block editor, you'll see normally we can put sprites in and just use the existing sprites, but this has this added benefit of using these fill pixel with color blocks in order to make its own art program, which is really cool. So I encourage you to go check that out, play around with it. You might just have fun making some pixel art. That is my arcade game pick of the week. It is Pix Artist with two X's, and that's by Game God. Really nicely done.